welcome in this video we'll talk about uh, script component uh, script component enables uh, uh, a SSH package to include and run custom script code uh, the script component can be used as a source as a transformation or a destination in this example uh, I will show you how you can use a script component uh, as a transformation first of all we will check our, our uh, source and uh, the data here you can see a query which we use for for our source our data source here you can see a column which we have and then the end of our table here uh, we have sales last year we'll try to sum up uh, all those rows here to get a final sum uh, to get the final value value of that uh, column sales last year and we will try to do that with uh, uh, script component okay let's begin first of all we use data flow task here and our source assistant we'll create new connection manager and we'll choose our server name just a second okay and we'll use adventure world 2012 as usual and now we will copy this query okay and use uh, data access mode uh, SQL command and pass this query in and everything seems fine okay now we will use a uh, script component and put on the form here and we'll choose uh, to use component type transformation as we said before and you will see now uh, we will connect this script component and open it and we will choose our input column we will choose our business entity id and uh, sales last year because we want to try to sum up this this uh, column here and uh, now we must define input and output column input column are as we said before those two column and uh, you must be aware that uh, if you going to put some script in the uh, if you're going to use uh, to sum up this column you must uh, be aware that uh, data type is here is uh, that's an assurance data type and we should create our column for uh, sum and uh, we should uh, use the same data type to avoid any inconvenience it's as we said assurance here and now we can we can create our script here okay just a second please to open it okay you see here that uh, it's uh, we have here uh, main script and uh, we have pre-execute uh, and uh, post-execute uh, part of the script we should delete this we do not need it okay also also post-execute okay and now we should define our variable it's as we said before it's decimal soon sales and put the value on zero okay now we use simple code for sum up rows and sum, sum sales is equal to sum sales plus plus row said it's sales last year yes and we put now uh, row some sales row some sales is equal to some sales it's very simple we uh, put the beginning value and zero and uh, just sum up the next row next row next row at the end we, we get the final sum just uh, save this 
close okay everything is okay now to view our data we will use the uh, drive column here and just connect and to put uh, enable data viewer and that's that okay execute package we get our data data here and we can view we can preview some sales you can see here uh, that uh, some sales value or sum up row by row row by row at the end we had we get uh, the final sum we could test this for example in, 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 in our Excel to see if uh, some is right yes. okay we have two three six eight five nine six three it's the same it's everything is everything is okay uh, okay there is another way to preview your data you know you can use uh, your account column I'll show you now just a second to find it yes row count and connect it and here you need, you need to use some variable you know, and you can create a simple variable here just row variable and now just select this and enable data viewer and just execute and we get the same result as the right column with the right column so, cool okay that will be all we talked today about uh, uh, how you can use a script component and uh, how you can preview the data from the script component how you can uh, uh, define uh, input and outputs and how to create a new column for output and script component and uh, that will be all and thank you for watching